Hi everyone, my name is Lauren and welcome to a brand new episode of Metal Gear Solid. We're currently playing through the 1998 version and I'm very excited to see what's next. Briefing. Oh, so these are the briefings. Okay, guys. Section 1, briefing M1 tank battle. Okay, so this is the briefing, guys. A lot of you told me to check the briefing. Um, and it's basically like a script, which I didn't realize that was going to be a thing. I don't want to read ahead too much because I don't want to get spoiled is the only thing. People have said I missed a lot of stuff as well, so I'm really sorry. Um, I think it's because I'm trying to, I tried to rush through it basically. Because I was like, oh, I don't want to get caught. Not realizing I was leaving loot behind. So this time I'm going to try and do it differently. Um, but if I do end up missing some stuff, it is my first time ever playing this game. So it happens. <laughs> Read mission log. Yes, please. The nuclear weapons disposal facility on Shadow Moses Island in Alaska's Fox Archipelago was captured by terrorists. They're demanding that the US government turn over the remains of the legendary soldier, Big Boss. And they're saying that if their demands are not met within 24 hours, they'll launch a nuclear weapon. Asked by the US government to settle the situation, former Foxhound member Solid Snake succeeds in the infiltration of the nuclear weapons disposal facility. He now must try and rescue the DARPA chief. Nice. Um, ration? What are you waiting for? Shoot! Don't talk to me like a rookie! Okay. I'm telling you, shoot! Ah! Nice one, Meryl. Get him, girl! Okay, here we go. Next. Okay. Nice. Get their ammo. Look at Meryl popping off. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna take this ration if I can. Can I? Oh shit! Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to like get all this stuff. Okay, is that all of them? Nice. Yeah, we did it guys. Nice, okay. At least we now know how to like use the rations. I had a quick look at like a video to see what the controls are like in this game. Thanks Apparently you can like help. choke out guards and stuff, which is cool. Wait. So I'm gonna have to like get used to all that. Why is <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> that close up? <laughs> was he was he checking her out? You fool! You've killed him! I'm sorry, sir. His mental shielding was very strong. I could not dive into his mind. Now we'll never get that detonation oh. code. Boss, I have a good idea. Hmm, I wonder who these people are. I'm sure we'll meet them soon enough. Dude, Meryl is popping up. Oh, she's shooting at me. Never mind, I thought she was shooting other people. I feel like you're wasting your rounds, girly. Oh shit, she left us behind. Oh shit, who the fuck is that? Hello? Good girl. Just like that. That sound like Darth Vader. Naomi, I just had some kind of hallucination. Is it from the nanomachines? No, Snake. The nanomachines are functioning properly. So what was it? It must have been psychometric interference coming from Psychomantis, Foxhound Psychic. Think of it as a mental feedback loop. So that was Mantis. Oh, interesting. Okay. Can we go into, into these? By the way, I've been loving the support on this game. It has absolutely been incredible. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, I need to use the, the card. I'm silly. Okay, 
I just want to see if we left any loot behind. Oh, the body's gone. There's nothing in here. Is there anything beneath your bed? There's nothing beneath her bed. Boo! Sitting on the toilet! What's down here? Oh, oh, jackpot! Oh, and some bullets. Yeah. Um, is this anything that we can like check out? Anything interesting here? No. All right. Well, I guess we're gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep this card with me because that means we can open other doors, which is fun. But that one doesn't open. Okay. Right, let's try the other level then, because that means we can probably like unlock loads of different stuff. Which is fun. Alright, let's see. How many of these open for us? Not this one. Oh! Oh my god, we're finding all the loot, guys. Nope. Nope. Oh, there's a door down there that we haven't used yet. Hold on, I'm just gonna test this one. Nice! Some grenades! Oh my gosh. Wait, does that mean we need them? I'm scared. <laughs> Um, okay, let's make a quick call to like save and stuff. Hey, mate. What can I do for you, Snake? I'd like to save, please. Apparently, you can keep calling her and she gets like really annoyed with you, which is something that I would like to try at some point. <laughs> I really like the dialogue in these. Snake, like Shakespeare said, not had, all spent. What our desire is got without content. Basically, it means that your desire can get you into trouble if you're not careful. That goes for items too. Don't get too greedy or ah. you might be sorry. Be careful, She's already snake. being like, <laughs> stop flirting with me. Right, I guess we're gonna we're gonna get going. I guess we're gonna go down here. Wait, we can't go down here? Really? Um, well maybe that means we have to go back up. Okay. Wait, what the heck? Oh, it says there's someone sleeping there. Apparently, I can choke him out. Hold on. Oh shit, there's an alarm. Okay. Oh shit, okay. Ow! <laughs> okay. We're okay. Anyone else? Oh god. I'm dead. Steak! <laughs> What's wrong? Snake! Snake! <laughs> That was silly. I should have um, hit him from the back. Come to mama. Okay, so if I do this. Okay. So ration. Oh shit, I had to not hold the weapon. Does that mean he's dead? Nice. Okay. Um, how is my life doing, by the way? Is my life okay? I hope it is. We have enough rations, though. Fuck. Where the fuck did they all come from? Oh 
I'm going. I'm running for it. <laughs> no! Oh god. I'm running for it, guys. camera right here well it gave me oh god <laughs> I'm not very sneaky people did warn me they can see my overall death counter at the end of this game and I'm slightly terrified <laughs> we're doing well so far we're doing well okay Hoping it's not gonna see me. Okay, nice. Nice! Oh my gosh, guys. We're doing so well. Don't ruin it now. Okay. Oh shit, we can't go in there. Fuck. Um. Oh god, I'm nervous. Can you guys see? I'm like... <laughs> Okay, 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 we did it. I might have missed a loot at the end. I'm really sorry if I did. Um, but I feel like we did better this time at least. And I checked the other floor. So like at least I kind of made up for the loot we missed before. So I have my card. Can I call for help? The walls that were submitted over should look slightly different. Look oh, the there's a fake in wall. First -person view mode. Try oh. to find the walls that have a different pattern. Okay. Did you try hitting the wall? Oh, it'll sound wow. too. Those C4 explosives you've got should be able to destroy the walls that were cemented over. Alright, let's try both. <laughs> I'll try punching it and I'll try... Oh wait, hold on. Let me just step back. Okay, so... It should be a different color, they said. I mean, that looks... This one looks really like broken, you know? Does that count? Or this one's different too. How do I put this down? Did I turn it on? Oh, I didn't even put it down. Hold on. It was square. I used the wrong button. Run! Hopefully this is far enough. Did it work? Oh, hell yeah! Okay. Here we go! Here we go again! Jamming? Oh shit, as in like I can't see anything? Oh hell no, I'm gonna save my game. Snake, you can't use your radar in that area. Oh shit. There's some kind of electronic jamming coming from there. No! Oh, I wonder what it is. Sabotage! Anyway, be careful. Okay. Oh, I can save. Okay, thank god. I thought she meant I couldn't. And I was like, excuse me? <laughs> Madam? Alright. No worries, thank you. So I guess one of the walls in here will be different. Oh, it's right here. 
Hold on. Um, wait, which room was it? Was it here? That was here. Hold on. Just want to make sure I'm right in front of it. Okay, I'm gonna stay over here. Take my gun out, because I don't trust this. Okay, nice. I know there's one there. Oh, there's one right in front of me. I reckon it'll be this one. Hold on. If I place it here, I might get both of them. Oh no, I wasted it. Fuck. Guys, I wasted it. Oh shit. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Can he get me? How do I use it? Okay. Oh my god. Um. Shit. Oh no. Oh god, how do I get in? Maybe I need that over there. Okay, quickly, go get it. I feel like I should really pay more attention to like rooms before I run into them. Fuck. Maybe it was this. I think I have one more left. Try it, I guess. Oh, okay. God, there's so much to learn about this game. Oh, sir, are you okay? Am I too late? He's alive. You're the arms tech president, Kenneth Baker, right? Don't worry, I'm here to save you. No, no, don't touch it. Oh. C4. Oh shit. Oh my god. <laughs> He's a ninja. Right. That's crazy. Touch that wire and the C4 will blow up along with the old man. Oh fuck. So you're the one that the boss keeps talking about. And you? Special Operations Foxhound. Revolver Ocelot. Oh shit. Is this a boss fight? Oh my god. I really spinning those guns around, my dude. Solid snake. Mm. Have you now? Now we'll see if the man can live up to the legend. Oh, you just wait. I'm this real good at choking. This is the greatest handgun ever made. The cult single action army. The way he's like stroking that Six gun, like damn, he loves his gun. Enough to kill anything that moves. The now voice I'll acting is so good, you guys. Oh my gosh. Revolver. Okay. Draw. Oh shit. I love 
Let's go. Nice. I'm just running after him now. Surprise! You better hurry up. The old man's not gonna last long. Oh, I don't have any more shit. Don't you want to settle this? I understand the bullet shoots. I make them go where I want. Do you now? Well, so do I, bitch. Oh god, I'm wasting my bullets. Oh, I don't need bullets left. You know, that's so smell. Maybe I need a grenade, but that might blow the other guy up. Disables electronics. I don't have a gun though, so I might have to go without guys. But to you, be the smell of your own death. Oh, nice. Oh shit, my life. Um, hold on. Wait a minute. Shit, I don't have any ammo left. Close. I need more, more bullets. Question is, where are they? Nice. I need more bullets. Shit. I need to wait for him to basically have shot all his bullets. Yes. Nice. Okay, I'm waiting for him to reload. Here we go. Shoot at me, bro. Come on, shoot at me. Ow. So can I use the wall to shoot or no? Wait a minute. Shit. Can I use the wall to reload, guys? Or no? Uh, to shoot, I mean. Do it? Oh, I did it. Okay, cool. Goodbye, yeah, Ocelot. Good. Just what I'd expect from the man with the same code as the boss. It's been a long time since I had such a good fight, but I'm just getting warmed up. What? My hand! Oh shit! What the? What just happened? Oh shit! Oh, everyone's dead. Okay. 
Oh no, the guy died. Camouflage. Oh shit. Can't you even die right? You were lucky. We'll meet again. Who are you? Are you nice? You don't look nice. I like you. <laughs> I like you. I can't believe it didn't explode. That exoskeleton. Oh, I feel like you're not nice. Oh, is this the Mind Flayer thing? Not Mind Flayer, that's Baldur's Gate, different game. <laughs> the guy who like controls the minds? Holy shit. Oh god, if I have to fight him, I'm fucked. Like, that'd be bad. <laughs> Uh oh. Can you talk? Who are you? I'm not one of them. The DARPA chief oh, told this me poor you gave old him his man. detonation code. What about yours? Oh, I get it. Jim sent you. You're, you're from the Pentagon. Answer my question. What about your code? There's no time. I talked. What? Now the terrorists have both codes and can launch any time. It's not like I didn't fight. I managed to resist Psycho Mantis's mind probe. He couldn't read you? How'd you do it? Surgical implants in my brain. Surgical implants? Kind of like a psychic insulation. Everyone who knows these top secret codes has it. Even the DARPA chief? Of course. But the DARPA chief said Mantis got his code by reading his mind. Are you sure you heard him right? Yeah, I'm sure. In that case, how did they get your code? I never had any training on how to resist torture. Oh, I can't blame him. <laughs> Poor looks man. Like he had some fun with you, all right. Oh, he's not human. I tell you, he loved every second of it. What happened to your arm? He broke it. Looks like you're more than even now. His was sliced off. Ha! Huh, you're a funny man. So the DARPA chief is he okay? Dead. What? I can't be. No, no, that's not what you promised, Jim. Now you want to <laughs> shut me up? Oh. The way he's just hitting us What's with this. I just told you I was here to save you. <laughs> I can't wait I to be an old lady and do that sometime, chief. like, or like with you my little hand or something. Ah. A heart attack? Oh, don't be a fool. Anyway, the terrorists have both codes now. Oh man. Those boys are totally insane. That's they not good. To launch. I agree. But what do they really want? Uh, who knows? Maybe they're like us in the arms industry. Always looking forward to the next good war. Well, I'm not gonna let these maniacs start a war today. You still have the card keys? Card keys? To override the detonation code. I heard you had them. No, not anymore. Oh, what? God. Who does that? Not the terrorists. No, that woman. <gasps> Meryl? Woman? Who? A soldier what twist? Was thrown in prison along with me. Meryl a has them. Oh god. Be. She said she had just joined up as a new recruit. They threw her in prison because she refused to take part in the rebellion. A new recruit? Could that be the colonel's niece? Oh. I gave her the key. Things Looks are like connecting now. I out of here though. I hope she's okay. I'm sure she is. She's green, but as tough as they come. But how did you know she escaped? I was in contact with her by codec. Until I was tied up here, that is. Codec? Yes, she stole it from the guard. If she still has it, you should be able to contact her. Oh, cool, we can speak I'm to sure her. I'm sure she still has it. What frequency was she at? Oh, yeah. Let me tell you, it's... Oh, they oh. killed him before? Sorry, I forgot. Damn! Oh, sorry. I thought, like, oh, that's right. the mind it control the back of the CD case. Try to contact her. I'll contact her right away. But tell me, if this doesn't work, is there some other way to prevent the missile launch? Hmm. You need to find Hal Emmerich, one of my employees. Okay. Who's that? The team leader of the Metal Gear Rex project. A genius at engineering, but a little bit of an oddball. If there's anyone who can figure out how to stop Metal Gear from launching, it's him. What if he can't come up with anything? You'll have to destroy it. Emmerich knows how to destroy Metal Gear. Where is this Emmerich? Well, he's probably being held somewhere in the... So many missions. Warhead storage building. Uh oh It's north okay. from here. That's where he worked. I understand, but... Looks like Metal we're gonna Gear? pay him a visit. The nuclear age ended with the turn of the millennium. Oh, you're wrong. 
The threat of nuclear war isn't gone. Let's be honest, it's never gone. It's greater than it's ever been. Great. Some really positive things the to look out to. Spent nuclear fuel and plutonium is increasing even today. Listen, have you ever seen a warehouse full of nuclear material? No. Drums and drums of nuclear waste stack this high. God, I don't know if I want to. As far as you can see. Because there's still no real way to dispose of the stuff. So they just close the lid and try to pretend like it'll go away? Uh, essentially, yes. The fact that this is real, though, is like kind of scary. <laughs> Many of the drums are corroded with nuclear waste. So ahead of, of its them. time. Unbelievable. This game was so Not ahead that, of its time. Several pounds of muff are reported every year. Muff? It stands for material unaccounted for. It proves that there's a large and well organized black market in nuclear materials. Furthermore, since the end of the Cold War, Russian nuclear engineers in particular are out of work with no way to turn. I like that he used real footage for that. Of available nuclear material and scientists for making a bomb. We live in an age when any small country can have a nuclear weapons program. What about the other superpowers? Uh, Russia and China still maintain a significant nuclear presence. Complete nuclear disarmament is an impossibility. To maintain our own policy of deterrence, we need a weapon of overwhelming power. Oh, it's always the case, isn't it? It's like, they have this. You we have to make sure we gear. have something bigger. Yes. And just like, you know, our industry try and one-up each other. As a result of the cuts in military budgets due to this so-called peace. I remember hearing a lot about mergers and takeovers among the big weapons makers. Yes. And after my company lost their bid to produce the Air Force's next line of fighter jet, the Metal Gear system was our last ace in the hole. That's why we pushed to have Metal Gear developed as a black project. Black project? Secret projects paid for by the Pentagon's black budget. You can avoid a lot of red tape and get a great lead time on your weapons production. And no one can bother you. Not even those bleeding heart liberals on the Military Oversight Committee. Good lord. Bribes. I prefer to think of it as good business. Anyway, Metal Gear was going to be formally adopted after the results of this exercise were analyzed. I don't give a crap about you and your company. Yes, that's about what I'd expect from a grunt like you. Here, th this is what you came for, right? What's that? A CD. An optical disc. It's all here. The main hard drive was destroyed by gunfire. This is the only remaining copy of the data. What God, we have to protect data? this with All our the life. Data collected from this exercise. Don't play dumb. I know you were sent to get this. I hid it from that sadistic maniac while he was torturing me. They don't know this disc exists. Make sure you report this to Jim. To your boss. Yeah, we should probably get it written down too. somewhere, somehow. It'll open up all security level two doors. Oh, sick. Can you walk? No. Guys, no, that probably means we can go back me. and, like, unlock all those they doors. Don't want anything else from me. I have one more question. Who or what was that ninja thing? It looked like you knew something. That ninja? That was Foxhound's dark little secret. Dark little secret? An experimental genome soldier. You know him? You should ask Dr. Naomi Hunter from Foxhound. She knows better than I. Okay. Naomi, we will. You've got to stop them. If it goes public, my company and I are finished. What? Doesn't Metal Gear use currently existing technology? What is Metal happening? Oh no, he's gonna die. What? Oh, it's the mind what controller. What did you do to me? No. no! They're killing everything oh, and no. everyone with information. Those Pentagon bastards! So, they, they actually went and did it! What are you talking about? They, they, they are just using you Wow, for the fact that he's trying to get these words out right now is really impressive. Oh... That doesn't know- that doesn't mean they know where we are and what we're doing. And what we have. What the hell? How do we know? Whose side is gonna Colonel, use the nuclear now stuff for what? Too. I have no idea. Don't lie to me. It looked like another heart attack, but... Some kind of poison? 
Well, there are lots of drugs that can cause Same thing happened to the other guy. Doses. Come on. For example, potassium chloride or dioxides, but we won't be able to tell without doing an autopsy. Damn. Snake, I want you and Meryl to work together. We're going to have to find her, her first, though. Than you can trust oh, no, me. we have her number, don't we? Get in contact with her. Or like frequency. Snake, there's a lot of electrical interference coming from there. It should be okay if you do burst transmission like us, but normal transmission is probably impossible. Try moving away from that area. Snake, get a hold of yourself. Naomi, what the hell was that ninja thing? A member of Foxhound? No. Are you sure? Yes, we have no one like that in our unit. Why did he is tell us to right? ask you, huh? Snake, I'm counting on you. She's lying. Why is she lying? Ooh, versus Revolver Ocelot. Is an ocelot named after someone famous? Hold on. Like a... Oh, it's a cat. A wild cat. Okay. Well, so he did. Um, I might just see if we can get the l level 2 card up. Um, is there anything else that we can loot in this room? Because we've given up all of our bullets now. No, we can't. Damn it. Okay. We can't go through here. Even with level 2. Oh, maybe we can go through here. Hold on. Shit, man. Why can't we go in any of these? The DARPA chief and President Baker. So now the terrorists know both detonation codes. Yeah, and on top of that, they both died right in front of my eyes. The same way. Snake. Now that the terrorists have both detonation What codes, if our group has something to do with it? Because why would Naomi lie about this? To use the detonation code release keys that Merrill's holding, or... Or find the Metal Gear chief engineer that President Baker mentioned, Hal Emmerich. In any case, you should contact Merrill by codec. Wasn't her frequency written on the back of the CD Yes, case? I need to get out of here first, though, I think. Um... First, the DARPA chief. And then President Baker die of a heart attack? Yeah, it smells pretty rotten to me. Master, do you know anything? It's kind of fun. We are being no. shown snippets that but the main character doesn't know. Something going on. Keep Builds your eyes tension. Open out there. Alfred Hitchcock used a similar technique for his films, where you could see the bomb, obviously. But then, okay, we're going out. We should try and contact her. Oh shit, there's people again. Well, that means we can loot, that's nice. Um, I wanna see if we can now try and contact... Oh shit, sorry. In any yes, I know I should. Um, let's check the CD if we can. Was it not on the back? Anyway, I'm just quickly gonna see if we can get into most of these doors and get some loot going. Let's try. Oh my god. Dead. <laughs> I. Does this work? Crawling backwards. <laughs> no one. No one will know. What about this one? How do I turn around? Okay. Nice. Okay, we have some bullets. That worked. No smoking? Should we smoke? <laughs> um, where is this guy going? Oh. 
Okay. In that case... Oh god, quick! Quickly! Oh god. Go! We're going back to the helicopter, guys. I wonder if we should, um... Oh shit, what the fuck? What is this? Is someone above? Oh my god! Is he gonna know? Is there someone here? I don't get it. Oh, is this where we can check the CD maybe? Hold on. Can I can I use this? What's this? Carper box? Hold up! Hold on! Shut the front door! Can we distract guards with this and pretend to be a box? Where was this this whole time? I could have been a box this whole time. Um, guys, I don't know. I honestly, I don't know what to do with this. Okay, so I just googled it. And it says, on the back of the PlayStation case is a screenshot of a codec conversation with Meryl showing her frequency 14015 in plain view. This is the only way to find out Meryl's codec number. At no point in the game will anyone tell you or is there any other way to find it? I thought it had something to do with like the physical, actual, real life CD. So, oh my god. So we can just put it in manually. Goddamn. Okay, so it's... One four zero fifteen, and I I was like, do I have to insert into a computer in this? Game? <laughs> okay, let's call let's call her. Who are you? I was oh, really there she is. You busted yourself out of there. The one from the prison. That's me. You're the colonel's niece, Meryl, right? No, it's not him. And just exactly who are you? I'm the fool that your uncle sent all alone into the middle of this whole mess. You came by yourself? I did. You think you're some kind of one-man army? I don't need lectures. You're just like your uncle, you know? How do you know my uncle? Oh, I can we feel tension between them, like... What's your name? I was shipping him my at me, but now I'm like, important. Meryl? Aha! Uh -huh. Could you be Snake? Are you Solid Snake? That's what some people call me. The legendary Solid Snake? Oh, you've you? heard um, my legendary name before. Sorry oh. about before. I wasn't sure if you were one of the good Taking guys. Taking her mask off. I knew you were. How? It's your eyes. My eyes? They're not soldiers' eyes. And they're rookies' eyes, right? <laughs> no, they're beautiful, compassionate oh. eyes. Oh. How just I love that he's just flirting with everyone. <laughs> he's got wrists, this man. Don't worry. You'll land back on them once you meet me. The reality is no match for the legend, I'm afraid. Oh, I don't believe that. Why did you look so surprised when you saw my face? Because you look just like him. You mean the terrorist leader, Liquid Snake? Yeah, you know him? You're not brothers, are you? I have no family. So what's the deal then? Who knows? Why don't you ask him? But first I want some information. You were involved in this exercise from the beginning. What exactly happened here? I'm sorry. I was captured along with President Baker right after the terrorist attack. That's okay. But what is this place? I don't think it's just a nuclear weapons disposal facility. Boy, oh boy, it's just like them. Nobody told you anything, did they? No, of course they didn't. Okay. You see, this place isn't really for disposing nuclear weapons. 
This base is about to spill the tea, guys. By a dummy corporation of arms tech. This is a civilian base. Right. For the development of Metal Gear. Mm. Colonel. Foxhound and the Next Generation Special Forces were Everyone's been lying. test launching of a dummy nuclear warhead. Why Foxhound? Because they're a special ops group used to handling top secret missions. They figured they could help keep it all hush hush. But we must have fired nuclear warheads before. Why just this time? I heard it was because this was to be a final test before the formal adoption of the Metal Gear program. Well, that's what I heard anyway. Uh, sounds kind of fishy. So what do you think the terrorists want? Mm, sorry, I I'm not sure. I was captured with President Baker right after the revolt started. Oh yeah, that's when he gave you the detonation code override keys, right? That's right. Amazing you were able to keep him hidden from the guards. Well, women have more hiding places than... <laughs> anyway, you met Baker, huh? How's he holding up? He's dead. What? Heart attack. Surprise! The DARPA chief. The chief died from a heart attack too? Yeah. I know it's suspicious Was AF. Sick or anything? No, not that I heard of. Well, I don't believe in coincidences. Something funny's going on. Hmm, sounds like it, but I have no idea what. Me neither. Yet. Do you know the person who designed Metal Gear? You mean Dr. Emmerich? Yes. Is he still alive? Probably. He should be in the research lab in the second floor basement of the nuclear warhead storage building to the north. Second floor basement? Yeah, that's where his lab is. I think they're forcing him to work on the nuclear launching program. So they'll need him alive until that's done anyway. Then we better do something before he finishes. You're right. In case we can't override the detonation code in time, I need to ask him how to destroy Metal Gear. Good call. You plan to take that thing on by yourself? Well, you're welcome to join me. It won't be the first time. Oh, that was pretty <sighs> epic. <laughs> What's the best way to get to the building where the doctor is being held? There's a cargo door on the first floor of this building that leads to the north. What's the security level of the door there? Five. But it's okay. I've got a level five card. Well, I've got to go save the doctor. You should go. I'm going with you. No way. You're still too green. I want you to hide somewhere. I'm not green. I kind of oh, wanted yes, to come along. Like, I think it would be really fun. You pause for just one second. She feels like a good head, asset to me. Over. I don't know. Good luck doesn't last forever. But he's probably I just protecting her. Happened. I just couldn't pull the trigger right away. I never had any problems in training. But when I thought about my bullets tearing through those soldiers' bodies, I, I hesitated. Shooting at targets She's an and shooting at living, breathing people are different. Ever since I was a little girl, I always dreamed about this being music. A wow! Every day of my life, I've trained my mind and body for the one day when I could finally see some real action. And now, so what now? You want to quit? I can't quit. I can't allow myself to quit now. Listen, Meryl. Everybody feels sick the first time they kill someone. Unfortunately, killing is one of those things that gets easier the more you do it. In a war, all of mankind's worst emotions, worst traits come out. It's, it's easier to forget what a sin is. Well, the survival of the fittest, and you know. But this isn't a war. It's a terrorist your life. action. You're just a little jumpy from the combat high. The adrenaline in your bloodstream is starting to thin out. Just take it easy. But I learned all about combat high at the academy. We'll talk about it later. For now, just think about keeping yourself alive. If I get out of here alive, I'll think about that other stuff. Okay. Let me try <laughs> to say this another way. She's cool. Stay the hell out of my way. <laughs> You're a real bastard. Just like my uncle. So far, I think she's one of my favorite characters. I told you, the real me is no match for the legend. <laughs> it looks like you were right. <laughs> okay, Snake. I'll be a good girl. We'll link up after I grab the doctor. Then we'll take care of the detonation code override. Gotcha. But listen, I know this area better than you. Call me if you have any questions. Okay. Be careful, okay? After I open up the cargo door, I'll contact you. Cool. Alright, you guys. On that note... I'm gonna... I'm gonna save the game and end the episode right there. What's up, Snake? Hi, I'd like to save, please. Nice. 
Snake, have you ever heard the saying, friendly counsel cuts off many foes? It means that a little bit of advice from friends can save you a lot of trouble. You should think about it. Hint. If She's giving a lot of hints, isn't she? If you need some information about something, please contact Colonel Campbell or someone else, okay? Okay. Right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure that if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more in the next episode. We will try and escape this place, I think. I think that's what we're doing next. And I really want to check out more of the conversations because I'm really enjoying the codec um, and listening into all the conversations. And I'm just excited to see where the story goes because I feel like I'm not really trusting a lot of people in the game so far because everyone keeps lying to us, even from our own team. So there's something shady going on there. Anyway, guys, have a lovely day and I'll see you soon. Bye.